Hey guys, hope you're all doing well. Hope you had a great weekend. Finally had the time to get through another box of Canadian pennies. Probably been a, a few weeks since my last penny update. And as you'll see, considering this box and the previous box, me and my brother have definitely been fortunate when it's come to coin roll hunting through boxes of pennies lately. In total, I found over 82% of copper pennies this week. I was going to weigh the containers but I found out when I did it overloaded my scale so maybe I'll just go through each container one by one. Definitely not a problem that I'm gonna be complaining about here guys. So first the 1996 to 1982 Canadian pennies I found six pounds and 5.3 ounces. Always going to take off an ounce for each container here. Next, for the 1980 and 1981 Canadian pennies, I found 1 pound and 6.2 ounces. Next, for the older Canadian copper pennies, from 1979 to I believe 1953 I found 3 pounds and 10.2 ounces maybe 10.3 ounces <laughs> and then lastly the copper American pennies for this week found 1 1 pound 1 1.4 ounces so I think in total that works out to be somewhere around 12 and a half pounds, which is really great. As you, I think our average is somewhere around six pounds for a week. So as you can see, definitely a great week when it comes to the Canadian copper pennies here. Now let me get into the more rare coins. By the way, I found 26 1982 American pennies, so I'll have to weigh those and make sure they're copper. And then maybe a little bit more interesting, I found seven Cana uh, Canadian King George pennies and then six American wheat pennies. The first King George penny is from 1941. Next, 1945. A 1946. One nineteen forty seven, two from nineteen fifty, and then lastly, a nineteen fifty one. All pretty much in decent condition. Now for the wheat pennies, the first from nineteen forty. Next from nineteen forty one. One from nineteen fifty one. A nineteen fifty three. A nineteen fifty six. And then lastly, one from nineteen fifty seven. And I believe they're either they either have no mint mark or a D mint mark. So that's it for this week, guys. Like I said, definitely happy with all the results. Lots of copper, 82%, I think, for the week. Over 12 and a half pounds. So definitely exciting. Thanks for watching, guys. If you could like, comment, and subscribe, me and my brother always appreciate it. Be on the lookout for more videos soon. Talk to you soon, guys.